welcome to Oslo, the last day of the Biathlon World Cup season, the last of the men's races due off any second now. And uh, as opposed to yesterday, where Johannes Tingisbo got a decent lead, a 24 second lead in the pursuit, it is all about the top 30 going head to head. Burt versus Ponsoloma on the range for the first shoot in the last race of the season. Ponsoloma is not hanging around and he may have paid a price there. Three out of three for Johannes Tingisbo. He misses number four. Uh, five goes down to onto the penalty loop. He's going clear with five. Filmaye does. Goal does. Hartbeck's clear. So a long line of athletes and then they double up back at uh, Johannes Tingisbo taking his time. He's not rushing this one. Watch out for the red dotted. And, uh, red dotted. Red dotted. And this from Goal and Ponsoloma and Sefala. Johannes Tingis again a little bit slower to get the first targets down. Hartbeck clears five with five this time Johannes Tingis is clear so over the road they go and uh, they've still got to climb up uh, gratis back in which is quite a steep climb and he could build himself a 15 second lead before he comes in to shoot for the penultimate time so still very intense great contrast to the last shoot yesterday this is the third of four that was smack in the middle, slightly left. Good shooting from Johannes Tingis. That is how to answer the opposition. And everyone else now playing a chasing game from 15 second lead. It's likely to be somewhere close to 25. They have to go clear to stay in this race. Christensen, four out of four. This could be the shoot that wins him the match start Crystal Globe. Remember, a top 11 finish. Uh, uh, it doesn't matter what Johannes Tingis bow if he can achieve that. Hartweg another five, so he's 15 out of 15. Hartbeck looks very, very comfortable, tucked in behind the Norwegian. And I think he's really just trying to play safe. He wants that podium. Even with two misses, there is a chance he could win. Well, there's the first. It just doesn't affect his nerve. This is the battle for second. And of course, we have three other athletes coming in very shortly. Hartbeck, 18 out of 18, 19 out of 19. The eight time this season he's hit the perfect score and Christensen has sealed the crystal globe for the mass start with another perfect finish. Hartbeck is pulling away but Filmaye is on the charge behind. Another win number 19. Could the season have gone any better? This is a brilliant result we're celebrating. Well done. Nicholas Hartbeck of Switzerland. He gets his second podium of the season. Christensen, <laughs> in 15 seconds, he hangs on. He was chased hard by Phil Mayer, who wanted a second podium here in Holman Holland. He does very deep, but Frenchman has to settle for four. Leibrit down in five, he ends the season in second place. And Ponsoloma once again shows what an incredible skier he is. First place and the winner, representing Norway, Norge. Johannes Tingnes Boom!